The exciting point of the window number two trial is that it has a one cohort with a low risk of mental cell lymphoma at the front line for younger patients. They do not need chemotherapy at all, and they did achieve a very good remission, and their remissions are so far durable. Many colleagues were looking forward to hear this presentation because in the past, we always treated this population, young patient with mental cell lymphoma, with the intensive chemotherapies. The Nordic therapy include six cycles of heavy chemotherapy induction followed the highest dose of chemotherapy you can deliver to a human and then rescue them with autologous stem cells. And at MD Anderson Center, where I come from, we use very six to eight cycles of very tough chemotherapy called hyper -CBAT. The chemotherapy is used so intensive, you have to be delivered that you admit the patient in the hospital for one week and then deliver that. It's not even doable in the community setting. So now all of a sudden, we at this window two trial have one cohort where no chemotherapy is needed. So that's why the excitement, that's why the patient and families and our colleagues are excited because we are moving towards the future. In the future, we hope that all the chemo, all the mental cell lymphoma therapies are treated with chemo-free therapies alone without the need of chemotherapy because chemotherapy is too toxic.